morning, Saints. Today is Monday, September 26, 2022. Happy birthday over the weekend to Dagan Eichels and Connor Zaporin. And happy birthday today to Colin Zaporin. The Saint of the Day today is Saint Pope Pope Saint Pope, Pope Saint Paul VI. He helped prepare this for the Second Vatican Council and was the one to complete it after the death of his predecessor, Pope Saint Pope Saint Paul so Pope Saint John the Twenty Third. In 1965, he instituted the Synod of Bishops and spoke to the United Nations General Assembly during a historic visit to New York City. This weekend, the cross-country team completed in Rim Rock Classic in Lawrence, a meet with over 300 schools from seven different states. The Saints completed in the, competed in the Gold Division against some of the region's best teams. The Varsity Girls finished 8th and were led by junior Sophie Spinello in 19th place. The Varsity Boys were 12th and senior Colby King set yet another Saints course record with his runner-up finish, 15 minutes and 19 seconds. The JV girls were third with sophomore Amelia Riddle leading the way in eighth place. The JV boys finished seventh and were led by freshman Brady Mallett. The C-team girls had a dominant victory with all 10 girls in the top 25 and a 1-2-3-4 finish from freshman Bridget Kenny, Keegan, Lindsay Abbott, Ellie Weaver, and Aya Freeman. Premier. Finally, the C team boys finished fifth place, and James Rod set the pace with 17 place finish. Tomorrow, Album Club will ha be having their first meeting. They will be listening and reviewing the college dropout by Kanye West. There will be snacks, and, there will, and they will be in the Ox Gym after the first bell of STA period tomorrow. And here's Mr. Blaze with, with an announcement. Howdy, Halo. Mr. Blaze here to give you the scoop on the next morning prayer the St. Michael the Archangel Prayer. St. Michael is the leader of God's armies and is the protector against the evil spirits that are actively on earth. St. Uh, Michael is celebrated in Judaism, Islam, and Christianity as the warrior against um, the devil um, and his armies. Now, faculty perspective. Mr. Thielen prays to St. Michael when he is, feels worried about the world and the evil spirits at work. He also is reminded to pray to his guardian angel when he prays to St. Michael. Mr. Best points out that all churches used to pray this prayer after Mass. Many local churches have restarted this tradition, and it is a great way to remember that we, that we are leaving Mass to engage in our life and a spiritual battle every day. This prayer reminds Mr. Best to fight the good fight and that the angels and the saints have his back in this battle with sin. Thespians, if you plan to attend the Thespian Conference in Wichita, please go to the Thespian Google Classroom as soon as possible and fill out the reservation form. Tomorrow is the last day to register. All information is on the Google site. If, we register late, if you register late, there's a $50 fee per attendee penalty. This weekend, the debate team went to St. James to seek revenge for homecoming. The team of Caitlin Cradlefield and Gabe McClellan and the team of Caitlin Conrad and Brooke Gunter both came away with the winning records, and the team of Olivia Giamanco and Dylan Sharma fi finished fi fifth in a field of 33. We are the KU football of debate. For prospective girls swim and dive team members, please feel free to volunteer. Fe please feel free to join the voluntary swim and dive conditioning program. We currently meet Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays from 4:30 to 5:15. If you would like to gain strength prior to the season, please meet in the weight room wearing workout clothes and athletic shoes. Hey Saints, this week is a big week for pro-life activities. Sign up for the DC March for Life trip. It takes place January 18th to January 23rd, 21st. But sign up start today and for Teens for Life members at today for Teen for Life members and tomorrow and beyond for all interested to sign up. Paperwork and deposits will be start accepted starting at 7.30 a.m. today and each morning in room 124 throughout the day until 3.30 or so. You can get sign-up papers from Mrs. Loafman, Mrs. Jones, or Mr. Best. You need parent signatures to sign up and the deposit. Thursday, September 29th, after the conferences, is Teens for Life game night in the auction. 8 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. Lots of games, cornhole, foursquare, trivia, spike ball, and more. Snacks and prizes for winners. Come have fun with friends and learn about pro-life info. Non-members pay $5 and Teens for Life members are free. October 1st is the first Saturday Mass prayer and breakfast. October 2nd is the life chain. Come pray with others from Kansas City on 95th Street for one hour. 
Show your support and solidarity for life. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, Calzones, and Bosco's. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now it's time for the word of the day. Today's word is sporadic. Sporadic means occurring occasionally, irregularly, or randomly. Saints, let's not be sporadically present in class today, but present at all times. Wow, I just did not know that. Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We'll be back with you more for next week. I'm Addie. And I'm Christina. Starting off, remember, remember stay classy, classy saints, and embrace the moment. moment.